As lockdown hobbies go, it's pretty unique. But from a suburban semi in Staffordshire, these 17-year-olds are on a mission. They've set up a back garden business, breeding reptiles and amphibians, so that eventually they can be restored to the wild. They're one of the most threatened groups of uh, species on, on Earth, so captive populations are vital to securing um, just the status, the conservation status of these animals. People don't understand the, the true importance of it. They think it's just people having pets or people you know, just having a bit of fun breeding animals in their back gardens, but it's really much more than that. Following conservation guidelines, the Friends are restoring species that are already or nearly extinct in Britain, and they've now secured financial backing to expand the business to land nearby. We've got about 20 species, of which we've got about 120 individuals, so it's a fairly, fairly sizable collection. And when we've got the new facility built, uh, that will be about as, many, about as many reptiles and amphibians as there are in Chester Zoo, so it's a pretty sizable collection. Yeah. Now these are sand lizards, they're the rarest lizards in Britain and they have been saved from extinction due to captive breeding and a proof that it can work. They're doing all of this at the same time as studying for their A-levels, but say lockdown has given them more time. We get the schoolwork done, you know, uh, sometimes it can be hard, but, um, we're, you know, it's, it's all about balance, isn't it? Because we need education as well as, um, as, well as running the business. They're doing what they can to save endangered species. And these impressive teenagers show age is no barrier to ambition. Leila Hayes, 5 News.